Hi everybody, this is Todd with Infusionsoft. Today, I'm going to be taking you through how to get started with Infusionsoft payments. So go ahead and log into your apps and go to the main navigation menu at the top left. From there, go over to e-commerce and click on e-commerce setup. Once you get to the e-commerce page, under the payments section, click on payment types. At the top of the payment types page, you'll see a new section for Infusionsoft payments. If you'd like to learn more about Infusionsoft payments, simply click the learn more link at the bottom of the left hand section. When you're ready to get started, on the right hand side, you'll see a drop down with all the admins inside of your application. Your name should be pre-selected. Whether it's you or another person in your app, the person you select here should be the financial representative of your company and should be listed on the bank account that you'll be connecting later on in the process. After you click get started, you'll be sent an activation email. If you don't find the email, you can come back here and click resend setup link. Here's the activation email that you'll receive. Simply click set up your account to get started. It'll be coming from support at wepay.com. WePay is a technology partner that we've chosen to power Infusionsoft payments. After clicking the button in the activation email, you'll be taken to this page to set up your Infusionsoft payments account password. For increased security, this password is separate from your Infusionsoft ID password. You'll use this later on to log into the management area of the Infusionsoft Payments console. After setting up your password, you'll be taken to the Infusionsoft Payments account setup page. On this page, you'll fill out information about your business so that you can create your Infusionsoft Payments account. When you're filling out this information, be sure to be as accurate and thorough as possible. Once you've completed everything, click the next button at the bottom of the page. This is the last step of the account setup process. Simply enter the routing and account number of your bank account, choose whether it's a checking or savings account, and then choose how often you'd like to receive your money from Infusionsoft payments, daily, weekly, or monthly. Again, make sure that the person that's signing up is an account holder on the account that you're entering here. When you're all done, click Add Bank, and that's it. You've now completed setup for your Infusionsoft payments account. You can now begin taking payments in the Infusionsoft shopping cart, order forms, or manually recording transactions in the CRM. If this is the first merchant account you've set up inside of Infusionsoft, you don't need to do anything else to get started processing payments. If you've previously been using other merchant accounts in the system, you'll see a new radio button option to select either your current merchant account or Infusionsoft payments as a default credit card processor inside of Infusionsoft. Simply select which one you'd like to use and then scroll down to the bottom of the page and click Save. If you have more questions, you can visit the Help Center at help.infusionsoft.com and search for Infusionsoft Payments. You can also contact the Infusionsoft support team via phone or chat.